What's up, man? What's wrong with you? I had a bad day at school. You had a bad day at school? Yeah, I felt like I got beat up. Not in a fight, but just mentally beat up. Just everything's on my back. A lot of pressure. And just, just a bad day at school. You feel like you took a loss today? Yeah, things didn't go my way today. Things didn't go your way? No. Well, you know, it's, 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 you know, it's rough, son. You know, but here's the thing. No matter what, you got to know this. When you go outside this door every morning, every time you go outside your door, there's a battlefield out there. And that battlefield is real tough. But there's another battle. And that battle is in your mind. So... When you go out in the morning, there's some things that you want to do that God gave us to be able to use, right? Yeah. So, you know, first you got to know what you're fighting. You're dealing with the spiritual uh, wickedness in places, uh, that in high places, in heavenly places. You're dealing with the powers, you know, of darkness. You're dealing with, uh, uh, um, you know, the rulers of this age, people that's in control. What you're not dealing with is the flesh. See, see, understand, son. God gave us a whole package. He gave us something huge to use to be able to go out there and stand against the tricks of the enemy, the tricks of the devil. He gave us something. You know what that thing is? No. The armor of God. Did you put the armor of God on this morning? No. Okay. So you came back and you felt like you lost the fight, right? like you lost the battle. Well, it's because you went out and you weren't prepared, son. So what we're going to do is get you squared away. We're going to get you prepared right now. Are you ready? Yes. Are you ready? Yes. Let's do it. Stand up, son. Here we go. I need you to put on the belt of truth, son. And with the belt of truth, you're going to walk and you're going to know truth. You're going to accept truth. You can't, And I don't want you to accept any lies out there. Believe the word and not the world. Now, I need you to put your breastplate of righteousness on. Ah. With this breastplate, you're going to be able to stand up for the right things. Speak up for the right things. Now, I need you to put your shoes, the shoes of the gospel of peace. Put them on your ah. feet. Everywhere you go, you bring peace with you. You don't bring chaos. You're, you're welcome wherever you go. Now, here's another thing. Take the shields up. Bang. This is the shield of faith. Keep your faith. Don't let nothing get you off your post. Don't let nothing get you off what has put you here. Don't let nothing take you off what you believe. And this shield will stop all the fiery darts that the enemy will send to you. Because he's going to send them some. And daddy won't be here. But he's going to send them. You understand? Right. He knows we're a target now. He's going to send them. But we putting on this armor. Now I need you to put on that helmet of salvation. Know who you belong to. Let's go ahead and put on that helmet of salvation. <laughs> now that you got the helmet of salvation on, protect your thoughts, but know who you belong to. And then I need you to take this sword. That is the sword of the spirit. And that is the word of God. And with the word of God, I'm going to tell you something. You're going to be able to sift through all the things that's going to come your way in Jesus' name, that he allows you to sift through, you understand? Yes. But I need you to pray. Always pray. If you don't pray, then guess what? That's the la That's the first and the last thing and the thing in between, the thing during the whole thing that you got to do. So what I've given you, son, is the armor of God, and you put it on the front. Notice we don't put it on the back because we don't retreat. We don't run. We stand up to the enemy. Do you understand what I'm saying? Yes. So, giving you all that, but what I need you to do is let me hear your war cry. Yeah! Ah! Now, go out there, son, in Jesus' name. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Proverbs 22 and 6. Train up a child in the way he should go so that when he is older, he will not depart from it.
Thank you, Jesus.